Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Athens Christian Reformed Church this morning. It is so good, as always, to be with you. Uh, yeah, I'm just pondering what a joy it is. Every, every time we are able to see a few more people come in person, it is so great that we can offer uh, the online service. Uh, that is absolutely fantastic. It's just not quite the same as being able to see one another face to face. And so we are very grateful for you if you are joining us in person. And we are extremely grateful for you if you are joining us online. And we long and hope for the day with great anticipation when we will be able to see everybody. Oh. Wouldn't it be neat if we could cram this place full and everybody was sitting shoulder to shoulder and that was not a problem? That would be fun. <laughs> Anyways, it is good to be with you this morning. For announcements, I just want to remind you again of the fact that we are seeking nominations for uh, the offices of elder and deacon. The nomination box uh, along with the forms are uh, at the um, down by the foyer, ah, there we go, and uh, so please be prayerfully considering that. Remember that the process is that if you feel like you would uh, are being called to nominate someone, you go and talk with that person and ask them, um, you know, whether or not you can nominate them. And this is this is good because a um, it is wonderful for that not to come out of the blue for somebody. And B, it also gives the opportunity for the person being nominated to hear that God may very well be calling them, not just from their prayer time, but also from godly brothers and sisters who are speaking into their lives. Um, this is not to shirk the responsibility of counsel in vetting the names for elders and deacons. That still happens. So when the nominations come through, then the elders and deacons together as full council, we look through those nominations, and if there are any uh, things that need to be discussed, we will discuss them. And so the process is being honored with that additional affirmation and step of speaking to one another. So other than that, those are all the announcements that I need to make at this moment. So would you please rise and receive God's greeting. Welcome, brothers and sisters, into this place. This place which is not a location on a map, but is the place where God's people dwell together in love and unity through the bond of the Spirit and the power of Jesus Christ our Savior. Welcome. In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Amen. 